Shock means inadequate tissue perfusion. In other words, organs aren't getting enough oxygen. There are four main types of shock. Hypovolemic, cardiogenic, distributive, and obstructive. In hypovolemic shock, there is a low circulating volume, and this can occur from either bleeding, dehydration, or burns. Treatment for hypovolemic shock involves replacing the lost fluid. Cardiogenic shock is a pump failure, and this can occur from having a heart attack or any arrhythmias. This type of shock often needs inotropes and specialist intensive care. Distributive shock is the result of excessive vasodilation, which can occur during sepsis. Treatment for distributive shock involves treating the underlying cause, i.e. getting on top of the infection, along with replacing lost fluids, and some people also need inotrope support as well. In obstructive shock, there is blockage to the circulation, and there are a few different causes, such as a pulmonary embolism, cardiac tamponade, or a tension pneumothorax. Treatment to resolve obstructive shock revolves around removing the blockage itself.